the last eight years uh, we've been running era 92 group but then why did we have to start a fund and i think that's the most uh, interesting story about our journey as you're trying to impact lives you know uh, for people living in you know under represented communities like slums we realized that there was one missing block in everything that we're doing over 300 people graduate every year and at end of their graduation realize that they don't have actually capital to start their small business get their first camera to become a freelancer biggest roadblock that i've ever had of every entrepreneur that i've made is at a certain point they needed capital to start whatever they, they are dreaming of that was my story you know when i was 19 when i had this idea of starting era 92 i didn't have any money until i was able to get a loan for 16 million uh, to buy the first equipment. And when I reflected on how all that stuff happened, I realized how millions of Ugandans till today, over 20 plus million Ugandans still can't have access to financial services. It's ridiculous. So the era 92 fund really started with the idea to impact the lives of the people that are within our ecosystem to create prosperity in frontier markets using microfinance and social entrepreneurship.